there's one activity that you probably do quite regularly that can become challenging, and that's getting in and out of the car, or actually in and out of the bath. And it works, all of these hip muscles here particularly, we've got to have a little bit of strength, haven't we, to be able to swing the leg out and get ourselves up. So here's two easy exercises, one sitting down and one standing up that you can do to build up the muscles around the hip joint for better strength and stability. Sit tall in an upright chair towards the front half or third so that you've got plenty of space to make the movement. All we're doing for this one is to take the foot out to the side and place it back, not too wide. If that feels okay, you've got no problems, Bring the foot a little bit higher as if you're stepping over something. You lift and step and back. And we just keep that slow rhythm going, trying to build up the repetitions to do the 10 on each side. You may start with just a small number of repetitions because as you progress, you want to start adding on to the number that you do. Watch out here that you're not popping your foot out and keeping the knee there because that will twist the knee so remember keep it in line lift and step lift and step and keep that good posture while you're doing it so let's look at the standing version now always good to have a kitchen work surface a chair or a table at your side so that you've got something to hold on to you haven't got to worry about your balance so standing tall engage your core muscles and hold on and then we're going to soften the knee on the supporting leg and take the foot out to the side and then pop it back down. So we're lifting not too high, you'll feel these muscles doing the work. And just nice and steady, especially as you lower the foot back down because you're working against gravity now. And the further you get towards 10, the harder it will be. We want it to be a little bit of a challenge so that it's a bit difficult but that you can do it without pain so building up to 10 and then repeat that on the other side and that should help you get out of the car a little more easily